Welcome to the WACS Daily News. Fuller Hospital has opened up a new wing that provides short-term intensive day treatment for adolescents ages 12 to 19 years old. This new wing will be used for Fuller Hospital's Inspire program. They recently held a ribbon cutting and to learn more about the program, we spoke with the organizers. Hey. <laughs> We're super excited to be here tonight. So we've worked diligently over the last 16 months to be able to open an adolescent partial hospitalization program. So we'll treat children ages 12 to 18 who need day mental health services. So as a diversion to inpatient um, or an ability to help a kid in a family who's struggling with mental health and or substance abuse issues. So what we're hoping is with all the relationships in the community, a new collaborative grant with Attleboro School District, um, as well as the marketing we've done in this community, to be able to serve kids in our community. I think as you know, we serve kids from all over New England and specifically all over Massachusetts and as far into Western Mass. This program would really be dedicated to kids in our community who are struggling and families who are struggling struggling. I think secondly, looking at a need. So the next adolescent program is in Pembroke. So people are coming as far as Worcester to go to that program and driving all the way to the Cape. So there's a need. So I think we saw a need, addressed a need, heard it from our community and the school system and from school nurses and counselors and social workers. So yeah, we put it together. I mean, I think that Fuller provides a continuum of care from inpatient to partial to in-home therapy and the ability to collaborate across departments and to treat adolescents on an inpatient unit, then impartial, then in in-home therapy. You have a whole, you know, just a ton of clinicians who are familiar with the same adolescent, and so we can really make sure that their care is consistent as they move through our programs. So we probably spent two full days touring the entire hospital. This was a couple of years ago, um, looking and thinking about what space would work best for expanding the partial program. And we looked at every corner of the hospital. This made the most sense because the patients have easier access to this than having to go up and, you know, this hospital is really big. So they're right near the front of the hospital for parents to drop off and pick up and adults to come in if they want to leave for lunch. It, the accessibility is much easier. That's it for today's update. You can watch all of our content by visiting our website, doubleacs.com, by downloading the AACS mobile app, or if you have a Roku, you can search for the AACS Roku channel. For AACS News, I'm Austin Ricketts. <laughs>